Republic of a boss on this one. It's over 50 years old, groundbreaking when it launched. One of the first shopping complexes of its kind. But having invested millions updating the Merrion Centre, our undercover boss wants to find out if it's going to continue to have a bright future. The team involved in the redevelopment of the Merrion are having a top-level meeting, and our undercover boss has thought up a novel way of listening in. The Merrion Centre has been a familiar uh, building for all of us through our childhood, and to see this transformation to a, an area of the city which has always been important and always well known, but perhaps has had lost its vibrancy, is, is very special. I think at the outset, when it was originally built in the 60s, it was an innovative development. It was a mixed-use scheme, genuinely ahead of its time. And I think we still innovate. I think the deal that we did with Leeds City Council regarding Merrion House was innovative. I think the car park and the way we run that. And then more recently, we've just launched the Ibis Styles Hotel with a Marco's New York Italian restaurant. To undertake major construction works whilst the shopping centre and the commercial centre is still running, is, is no mean feat and particularly because we've used different architects, we've had different engineers and they've all had to work hard together to make it work. Challenging to say the least in town in the city centre, obviously dealing with the public and your interface with them so the health and safety point of view it's, it's rather difficult but obviously we get over the problems working with a good team, design teams, the client, TCS. So we've been working with TCS for probably over 15 years and the team that, that they put together really do work collaboratively, look at trying to drive real value for both the project and for the client and for the community. I think there's been a lot of changes to the Marine Centre in the last few years. There's New Marine House which you can see, excellent project, will be a big change for Leeds City Council, really improve their facilities significant improvements to the shops within the Merion Centre. It's generally uplifted. Leeds City Council are moving in. They're, they're the sole occupier. Uh, it's going to be a great building. It's going to be the, the face of Leeds City Council to the public. So it's a big statement for, for the whole city. So the challenge was we had a 50-year-old car park which was in a poor state of repair. The only viable solution had previously been to pull the floors out, which um, would have been very challenging. But we came up with a structural wallpapering solution which was to put carbon fibre on the underside of all the floors, which meant the car park could stay open. Innovative insofar as it had not been done before in the UK, and TCS were very bold in, in embracing the solution. The soul that you have in an asset and in a building, you, you can't build that in. You know, that comes over time. And I think the work that we've done, hopefully, is recognised as a game changer, and perhaps even more than a game changer. Perhaps this is lead changing stuff. So the future of the iconic Merrion Centre seems assured, unlike the job prospects of our undercover boss. See anyone? I mean, you've got to understand. Really. <laughs> <laughs> that was quite good. Bad news, Chris. I'm afraid you haven't got the job. Oh, yeah.